Hi, I'm Peyton Lozon. Um, I graduated from Boulder Creek High School in May 2018. My dad is originally from Arizona and then my mom also went to high school. They actually both went to Deer Valley High School. And I started in kindergarten at Anthem School, elementary school. And then from there, I went to Diamond Canyon Elementary School from first to eighth grade and then Boulder Creek all four years. Anthem was all I really knew, so I really enjoyed my time there. It was fun. There was a lot to do, like walking around with my friends. Obviously, we were too young to drive, but there were places to go, things to do. My sister was a dancer, so growing up, I watched her and I would be like, Mom, I want to be like Kaylee. That's when I got into that, and I also kind of fell in love with math because at Diamond Canyon, they had like the accelerated learning programs and so I got into the math one. I think it was like fourth grade. I always liked math and I always liked ballet, which was helpful for me going into high school. And then my sister also was in the dance program at Boulder Creek and Stacy Shane, the director of it, um, also taught at my studio, oh, Arizona Dance Artistry. So I knew her and I knew my sister loved her. So I was really excited to join that program in high school as well. Stacey Shane has done a phenomenal job with creating this program, basically. She's worked it up. There's different levels, there's different... She even had like multiple like student teachers coming in, so a lot of guest choreographers. So we got to work with a lot of people in the area, um, which I thought was really cool. I know like talking to my friends from college, they didn't even have dance at their high school. So every time I would mention it, they'd be like, what? And like you weren't at a performing arts school, but you danced. So that was really cool to have that experience to still be like at a public school, but be able to do what I wanted to do. I obviously knew I wanted to dance, but I saw people like start in the beginning fundamentals classes and then by senior year decide that they wanted to do something with dance, whether it's like teaching or performing. So I thought it was really cool that it gave people an opportunity to kind of start late in dance because historically like with careers in dance, it's something that you do since you're little and then you work your way up. So I thought it was neat that you can start in high school and still decide you wanted to do it. At the beginning of the year, she would sit us down and be like, if there's any songs you want to dance to this year, or things you think that would work for a different class, like asking us for recommendations on music. It was nice to like be a part of the process because especially now, like in the professional world, like it's given to you and you do it. And I think that's similar for most lines of work, but particularly performance work. For me, like I thought college was important. So I worked with Stacey Shane. I worked with my mentors from my home studio. I also worked with the counselors at Boulder Creek and just like made a big long list of schools that would be able to incorporate dance as I wanted it to be like a huge part. And then also like math and science and like regular learning stuff on the side as well. I went to Indiana University in Bloomington and I just graduated from there in May 2022 with a degree. Um, it's a bachelor's of science in ballet with an outside field in astronomy and astrophysics. And they said I was the first person to ever do that. <laughs> When I got hired with Nevada Ballet Theater this past year, I was brought in as an apprentice. When I got my job, Stacy Shane was one of the first person I emailed. <laughs> I was like, Stacy, I didn't have a professional. I was promoted to a full company member. Kind of reached the end goal. This has always been the dream, I guess. So I'm super excited about that. And the other end goal, I guess, obviously you can't dance forever. Um, body-wise, like health-wise, it can't happen forever, but that's why I also studied astronomy and astrophysics. So ultimately I do want to go back to school and do more with that, like a master's degree or something, and then see where that can take me after ballet is done. For all the DVUSD teachers, um, first of all, thank you. Uh, I look back on my experiences with nothing but the fondest feelings. Also, thank you for like supporting outside interests because I know even my academic teachers, like they would come to my ballet performances of the Nutcracker. Um, so just like still being supported, like 
supportive of our school interests, but also outside of school interests. I think that was super cool for me. And then for our students, it feels long now, but eventually you can get to where you've always dreamed of. So don't let it feel too long, but also know that high school goes by fast. And one day you'll miss it, so. Very well said. Are you missing it? A little, yeah. A I, little? I Again, like I have friends who will say like, oh, I hated high school, that wasn't for me, but I'm always like, I had fun. <laughs>